good morning. Sun is not up yet, hasn't started rising. I've uh, come for a walk down here to the pier on the eastern side of the island again to Old Town because I want to get the drone up. The weather's been very, very clear the last couple of days, a couple of really nice sunny days. And um, yeah, I want to get the drone up and see if I can get some uh, some uh, sunrise footage over this really beautiful picturesque bay. Now, I'm walking out to the end of the pier because I'm not sure that you can actually take the rod, the motorbike out there. Um, so it's a fairly long pier. Yeah, so I'm going to walk out there. You know, I, how long have I been doing this now? And I still keep looking at the screen instead of looking at the camera on the iPhone. It annoys the shit out of me when I look at back, back at the video and start editing. But, you know, I guess, you know, some rookie errors, you just got to keep making them over and over again. Yeah, so good morning to everyone. And uh, I'll... Um, get all this set up going very shortly it's uh not even really started to get light yet but yeah so anyway we'll see how it goes oh i just saw a shooting star is that the one that's gonna uh, do to us what it did to the dinosaurs apparently anyway i'll spin the camera around and take a couple of photos of the wharf here it looks quite pretty actually not exceptional lighting, but uh, just having a chat with this lady here who's uh, down here catching squid. And I think they're uh, attracted to the light. As you can see down there, there's quite a few small fish swimming around the light and uh, looking at her bait there. So she's got this light set up under the pier and uh, catching the squid down here. Ah, there you can see. Got a couple, got a few there. Got up early, I was up at four o'clock and uh, came out here to get the drone up while the sun was coming up. I could have stayed a little bit longer and got some better shots. I might actually throw the drone back up here because it, it is looking pretty damn good. So I thought I'd wander over here and have a look at this old uh, shipwreck. Older traditional style Thai cargo boat, and uh, lots of birds, 
lots of birds around this morning. It is really pretty here. There's an old uh, brick tower there. Looking really pretty. Looking really pretty. <laughs> I guess really you can understand why I love it here so much. It's just absolutely special, I'm telling you. Yeah, so I'll go back and get on the bike now and go home and have another cup of coffee. And uh, yeah, just relax. Haven't decided what I'll do today. Decisions, decisions. I do the washing up, I put my washing out in the sun to dry. Well, I just lay on the sofa and look out the front door at the garden. You know, it's just all too hard, these decisions. Retirement, I hate it, you know? Really? Can't you see how displeased I am with being retired? <laughs> look at that, it's just special out there. Yeah really is a magic morning and it's like that a lot here although we have had a lot of rain it's been wonderful to have a couple of really nice fine days so um yeah you know it is what it is it's terrible being so stoic here <laughs> enjoy people yeah look please share the videos <laughs> yeah, no, I, I know, I, I don't push it too much, but, you know, please share the videos. If you share them, someone else will watch them, and I might get some more subscribers, you know. If I get to a 1,000 subscribers, you know, I'm a third of the way there, a bit more than a third of the way there. If I get a 1,000 subscribers, you know, and I'm not going to buy them like some other people do. If I get a 1,000 subscribers, I might make a few cents off uh, YouTube, and uh, it might inspire me to actually, yeah get some more content out there i'm still at the ferry terminal or the boat terminal the tourism terminal yeah but uh look at that It is pretty good. All right, I'm going to walk back down and get on the bike and go home and have another coffee now. Ciao for now. So, uh, when you take hidden little side roads, sometimes you find some amazing stuff. And I've found this resort that has no guests at the moment. I don't think he's actually open at the moment. I mean, uh, I think uh, COVID really killed him here. So, you know, what, what a pretty little place. This is right on the very southern tip of the island. It's really, really pretty. That noise is the guy got his uh, pressure washer going doing his car. But uh, look, there's, uh, you know, dinosaurs and all sorts of stuff here. Over here we've got dam, 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 ma. So look at these places set here in the jungle right on the southern tip of the island and the guys just told me that I can uh, go for a little walk around and these rent from uh, when it's open and they're renting they rent from 800 a night to 2500 a night well I would assume 2500 a night they're pretty good what a, what a really wonderful place what a really wonderful place. You've got all these uh, statues and things here. Giraffes and critters. I think 
I think this is the place someone told me about that has all these statues and things around. Look at this place, imagine, what a lovely place to stay. Just fantastic. And uh, I believe it was like Mushroom Central down here. Because uh, years ago, all the hippie crew used to come down here and have mushroom parties, stay here and have mushroom parties. It's pretty, really is pretty. <coughs> I think there's a creek of some kind down there. I can hear it flowing, but it's right in the jungle. Look at that, right in the jungle. This is an amazing place, an amazing place. I'm gonna go down to the ocean side of it. Just amazing, it really is a beautiful place. Look at that palm. I did pay a million dollars for that in Australia. Have a look at it. Yes, so just decided not to go straight home from the pier. This is Dam. Dam in Thai means black. Dam, Dam, money. Scared the crap out of me when I first arrived here. Came up growling and barking. Dam! Dam! Say hello. Beautiful dog. Beautiful dog. Dam! Mm, look at the setting. Would you like to stay here? Would you like to stay here? I'll see if I can get some contact details for this place. Though, I'm not sure it's open at the moment. He doesn't have any guests here at the moment. But, uh, yeah, have a look at it. There's the bar. Trasta bar. Look at that. Huh? Look at this place. Wow, what a find, what a find. And this is right on the very southern tip of Kotlanta. All that up the back there is the National Park. This is probably part of the National Park too. Nice restaurant. Restaurant there, right on the water. Great place to have breakfast. A great place to have breakfast, you know, because look at the view. Look at the view. Wow. Private beach over there. Not real great for swimming because uh, it's all rocks. This is the southernmost tip of the island. What a little find. What happens when you take little side roads and you don't know where they go, but it's all part of discovering the island, exploring the island. I'd imagine, I would imagine that would be very good fishing here. Yeah. Oh, wow. The restaurant looks beautiful. What a setting. Look where this place is. I mean, let me do a 360 for you. That's the view from the restaurant when you're having your breakfast. Some uh, other islands over there. Look at those nice bungalows up here. And a pool and a pool with a cave, a pool with a cave and a bar. What a place, what a place in the National Park. The ideal retreat, this is the ideal retreat. This is about half an hour, 30 minutes from town on this side, oh, about 20 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes into Old Town 
and about 30 minutes over to the other side of the island. Wow, really is pretty. What a little find. Oh, I'm very happy I took that side road. This obviously is their restaurant when it's working. City hasn't been open since like COVID, so COVID's done a lot of damage to a lot of people on the island. It really has, but look at this. Huh? Very special. And and that's what you get to uh, look at while you're sitting here eating your breakfast. Absolutely incredible. These bungalows, they're uh, built like uh, sort of boats. Yeah. It's the pool area. What a place. What a place. What do you think of this? Would you like to come and stay here? Make some comments in the video when I get it edited and posted. Who would like a lovely retreat here? Not really a tourist trap. Yeah, incredible. P Rasta. P means like older brother or older sister. Yeah, so, yeah, what a place. What a place. Quite a fortuitous little uh, side road trip, this one on my way home it really is pretty mind you that black dog scared the absolute crap out of me I tell you there he is there damn 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 what are you doing what's in there yeah me, I like me, uh, Ling Ting Ling Ling Ting 